Nerdy Nerdigans, this is the one and only Packer Girl 89 of Nerdigans Inc. And today's manga Nerdigan live reaction video is going to be for the Four Nights of the Apocalypse chapter 86. So before I get into this recap and live reaction, let me just remind you to hit that like, share, and subscribe buttons. And because, of course, this channel, let alone this video, are not sponsored. If you love what we're doing and want to help keep this operation alive and kicking so we can keep bringing you more anime and manga content, whether it be news, analysis, or live reactions like this one, Feel free to hit up our cash up and PayPal links are in the description box below. So, um, okay. First of all, we know the latest trailer came out for Grudge of Entenberg. I will cover that hopefully today. Um, so stay tuned for that. Uh, last chapter of Four Nights of the Apocalypse, we got more information in regards to Camelot, the because of what Jericho did, the road was sealed, but I'm telling you, Pelagard is going to turn, and that's how um, the road is going to be unlocked. Um, there is a catch, though, that full breeds cannot go in, but mixed breeds can, so that's how Tristan and Lancelot are going to get in. Um, but as, you know, the atmosphere was getting more and more depressing, Percival was like, hey, you know what, let's go on an adventure. I fucking love him so much for that. It's very, very Goku-esque. But anyways, let's get to this chapter, see what's in store for us this weekend. Of course, we got the waifus on the cover. Yee. But I have to point this out in regards to Isolde, because I saw so many people in regards to the um, muscular uh, women um, in uh, Pokemon in terms of the NPCs. They were thirsting over them, and I'm like, really? Isold and you got, you know, like full power uh Gawain. You have them as waifus and you're you're saying these are waifus? No, 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 no. You you must have never read Four Nights of the Apocalypse if you, you believe these are waifus. Stop, 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 stop. Full stop. Seriously. Anyways, I mean, look at this ass. We got a nice ass shot here of Isold. She got a nice ass. Anyways. Um Percival cut through the depressing atmosphere. Everyone was filled with hope. And this chapter is titled Sprouts. Look at Gawain. Gawain looks so cute. She's so cute. Please come again. This cake is so yummy. Yeah, the apple sourness and sweet uh, sweetness plus the soft dough are the best parts. Hey, Percival, could you remember this cake so we can um, have some uh, anytime we stop somewhere? But then our bag would be totally stuck with cooking utensils, wouldn't they? By the way, where have Nysons and Donnie gone off to? Nysons is at the Hendrix Clinic. Of course he is. Yeah, that, uh, that reminds me. I think he said something about turning down that assistant job. There's theories on, uh, yeah, on Taz I read it that uh, Nysons is a girl. I'm like, no, 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 no. I do not need this to be like uh, Jujika no Rokinen with uh, with my baby Kyo, where or um, where they believe uh, on um, what was it Jujika no Rokinen uh, wiki that uh, Kyo is a girl. No, Kyo is a androgynous man. He's a beautiful androgynous man, creepy but beautiful androgynous man nevertheless. But not. Nah. Nysons is a man until uh, Nakaba says otherwise. Please, please don't say Nysons is a girl. Seriously, I don't want it. No, 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 no. I don't want Nysons to be a girl. Why? Why Why would you say Nysons is a girl? No, he, he's my adorable boy. L leave him be. And Donnie went to pay respects to his grandparents. <laughs> well, I'll be. <laughs> well, I'll be. I didn't expect him to have a good time like that, and you bitch. Man, shouldn't you tell your father he became a holy knight? Oh, look at my keys. He's been fussy this morning, but now he's being a sweetie pie. That's the problem. He told me to come straight home. Um, straight home once I finish my duty. I really want to go out. I really want to go out and adventure with you guys today, even right now. Didn't Sir Meliodas say it would take until tomorrow to prepare our new clothes and equipment? Mm, that he did. Let's see. Come to think of it, I was surprised to think the king of the human nation is also king of the demons who fought, who once fought humans. Well, he's the former king of the demons. I don't think he's king anymore. I think, uh, yeah, Zoltoris is king now, right? 
But Meliodas is a good guy. I heard he fought on the side and a human side in the Holy War. Maybe he did, but a shock's still a shock, you know? Like how he looked nothing like his wanted poster. <laughs> so if I turned out to um out not to be human, would you hate me? Don't you remember what I said? Whether you're ordinary or not, you're still you. Aww. And I and I love you. The ship. The ship. What? The ship. What? Um. And Nysons and Donnie. Th don't cling to me that hard. Why not? You fucking first floor <laughs> bastard. Seriously, you were in. You're in. Um. You really need to work on your personal space. Got it? When it comes to women, you need to be more. Uh, don't you dare do anything weird with any girls. Ooh. How weird! I suppose your grandfather never taught you the most important rule, did he? Things like feeling up a girl's breasts like nothing's wrong and sticking your face up her skirt and sniffing it are off limits. <laughs> Guys, like, what the fuck is going on? But girls feel soft and sm um, smell really good, don't they? <laughs> don't say that. Don't say that like some big shot person. I fucking love you so much for this. Oh my god. Either way, just don't uh, people start questioning our honors the personal platoon. This is so much like Meliodas, let's be real. <laughs> Alright, I'll stop. I'm glad you understand. I haven't seen any girls in my life before, so it was all so new to me, but I get it. <laughs> Dude, this is so much like Denji, it's not even funny. You're that you're that depressed about it? Dude. Of course he depressed that is that depressed about it. Oh you fine, I get it. Get what? As long as it's <gasps> as long as it's just me, then sometimes sometimes I'll let you feel me up a bit uh, up a little. Wait, 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 what? Percival, <gasps> the ship. The ship. The ship. Percival, you are in. You are in, my dude. Hooray! You're way too honest. Way too honest. Can we do it right now? Just for the record, I don't see what that was fast, but that, for just for the record, I don't see him as a man you hear. Liar. Liar. Oh, hey, listen to me. Toon, he just went in on them titties. Ooh, she liked it too. <laughs> Are you going to be our leader from now on? So soft, so soft. In trouble if we don't get stronger so you smell so good <laughs> you lied to my titty what do you want just listen to me just listen to me i mean ooh. niceness is mad or shook it i could see people want niceness to be a girl like i know some people want nice i want niceness to be a boy just because He's look because androgyny, but Mofo, I mean, Mofo, don't you want niceness to be a guy so you can have the gayness of it all? Like, seriously. If niceness is a girl, will I be mad? No. But, I mean, wouldn't he be shooketh because it's like, dude, my, my, my man had some titty. <laughs> like, what the fuck is going on? Leoness, if you look closely, it's quite a, be a beautiful kingdom. Of course, my own hometown is also a beautiful place. Someday I wish to show uh, show you my home standing on the shore of a lake surrounded by beautiful trees. You simply must have my granny's pudding while we uh, watch the full moon reflected in the lake. No, with you, I need uh, nothing else but time. Let us join in each other's uh, soft embrace and create a passionate poem filled with appreciation for the lovely scenery. Right, Lady Isol? Lady Isold, <laughs> right, Lady Isold, Lady Isold, <laughs> good <great. laughs> Lady Isold, Lady, uh, Lady Isold, huh? <laughs> so Tris is like, what the fuck, dude? Gwen's like at the perfect height. She can look up that skirt, no problem. I mean, you want your LGBT representation? There it is! You got it with Gwen. 
Sir Tristan, are you in good health? Uh, she's just ignoring her. Poor, poor, poor Gwen. Lady, Lady Isol seems to be, um, seems to be coming a team and really is more trouble than I imagined. My wounds have healed, but it feels like every inch of me is screaming. Sir Tristan, please stop being so reckless for my sake. What would happen if you can't return to how you are? I truly worry for, uh, for you so, so, so much. It feels like my chest is about to burst. <laughs> Dude, <laughs> Kawhi was like, yeah, get the tease out. I'm sorry when I saw you get knocked down, uh, knocked aside by that monster. I just lost control of myself. We, the Tristan Platoon, are here to protect you. Please don't. Ever, wait, we, the Tristan Platoon, are here to protect you. Please don't ever risk yourself for us uh, ever again. I'm glad you feel this way, but may I refuse? Huh? All of us are partners. None of us are above or beneath each other. Such a naive prince. You don't seem to understand your position. You know the story, Isol, about the heroes who, um, whose races, birthplaces, personalities, and ways of thinking are, uh, were different, but they nevertheless overcame every trial thrown their way? The seven deadly sins. I've always wanted to be just like them. With all of you. Aww. As you command, Sir Tristan, think of me... Sir Tristan thinks of me of all people as an important friend and companion. As long as I can dedicate my life to him, I don't need anything else. Um, even if my feelings don't reach you or if you don't see me as a woman, I don't care. Oh, perfect timing. Just hold that pose. <gasps> there. Oh, new ribbon. Huh? This is, huh? Um, it's a new ribbon. A ribbon really does suit you. You look so cute. But is it really fair if I'm the only one who gets one? Um. <laughs> but is it really fair if I'm the only one who gets one? Good point. Should I get one for G uh, Gianna G2? Airhead. Huh? Uh, I'm, I will treasure it forever. You don't have to, uh, you don't have to. If it gets tired again, I'll get you a new one. Ridiculous. I'm going back to bed. Once I do, you two can speak of love, take each other's chastity, and do whatever you like. Lady Gawain? Take our chastity tool. <laughs> He's also like, yeah. What the hell am I doing? Come to think of it, I don't even know where she wound up staying the night. How are we, uh, uh, how are we even going to meet up? <gasps> what have you here? Lancelot? A land? Lance! You came to see me after all. I'm, I'm so happy. I knew you'd come and see me. Is that right? I said, I knew you come see me that, right? <laughs> Correct. You met Gawain, right? Yeah. And then you make, uh, met your teacher, too. Yeah. But, yeah, seriously, who are you? I told you already, I told you already, didn't I? I'm your lover. You're way too familiar with me. You're so shy. How cute. The two are getting along so well, but isn't there something unusual about it? <gasps> Ooh, Lancelot picked things back up with the, uh, with the black-haired girl. Uh, black-haired girl Guinevere, but who is the shadow approaching behind? To be continued in chapter 87, Guinevere, I am so fucking happy. The ships are moving, the ships are moving, the ships are moving. Oh my god, oh my god. Dude, the, the ones that are winning this week are Percival and Lancelot. Those two are winning. Esau kind of won. She did. Tristan's fucking clue. Tristan, you're a fucking idiot. Like, come on. Gwen's spelling it out for you. You're so stupid. But Percival, dude, my dude, out of all people, Percival, my man won. Anne said you can have titty. Anne said you can grope. Anne said you can motorboat. Anne said you can look up skirt, or her skirt. Dude, Percival is fucking winning. Percival won. Per let's be fucking real. Percival won this chapter. He won this fucking chapter. Poor Gwen. Gwen lost this week. Gwen fucking lost. Well, maybe Gwen won because she got to look up Isolde's skirt. But dude, Percival won. Percival is win. Uh, Percival is winning. Percival won. Percival fucking won this week. But next week we get we get Lancelot and Guinevere. Holy shit! I am happy as fuck. But dude, my boy Percival is winning. Percival won. He won. He won. But, like, looking at what's going down with Nysons, I can see why Reddit was talking about wanting um, Nysons to be a girl. If Nysons is a girl, 
that would be very interesting. But I really kind of want Nysons to be a guy. I do. Um, and from actually from what people were, were also saying in the Reddit, um, and I totally forgot about this until they mentioned it, was they said that um, about what Nakaba already said that, you know, Nysons sees uh, Percival as, remember, how he feels about Percival as his first friend. And you know what that means. What he probably thinks, and a lot of people, you know, this happens when you're growing up, is that he sees Anne as taking away his first friend. And he does not, he is not happy about that. That's what it seems like to me. Um, but I'm really curious what you guys think. Do you guys think that there is a ship happening there? I don't know. Uh, I will point this out, though, because Donnie hinted that there was probably a ship um, going down. And that, and I could, that's why I'm like, yeah, Don, Don could have, if there is a ship going down between Nysons and, uh, um, like, where Nysons does have feelings for Percival, Donnie could have been, Donnie was the one that foreshadowed it. But, and there's, like, unrequited feelings. That would be very interesting. Ooh, and Nakaba, I will tell you this right now, if you go this route, ooh, you will get mofos to shut the fuck up, especially in the West. But Lolly Gwen is just pure cuteness. I love her so much. And I want to point this out as well. Notice how um, the shorties, uh, Percival and Gwen, but Shoda and the the lolly, so to speak, are the lewdest ones. <laughs> and technically, you can make the argument that Guinevere is too. Guinevere is a lolly as well. The lollies and the Shodas are the are the lewdest ones of the bunch. I fucking. <laughs> what is it with you, Nakaba, making the lollies and the Shodas the uh, the lewdest ones of the bunch? That's fucking hilarious if you think about it. But I'm very curious what you guys think. Um, I, I do, but what do you guys think about what Isolde said when, uh, um, when Gwen was talking about her chastity? She was like, oh man, she was down. <laughs> Let me know your thoughts in the comment section below what you guys think. Um, what do you guys think of this chapter? Do you guys think Percival won this week and that Lancelot's going to, something going to go down with Lancelot? But there's also this factor here as well. Remember what was said in regards to um, uh, Arthur, that they found his waifu. Is Guinevere going to get kidnapped next chapter? That is a possibility. Oh, shit. Remember what happened with, uh, um, remember the whole thing with Arthur and Lancelot that Lancelot technically whooped Arthur's ass and he was trolling his ass and they find out that Arthur is getting that uh, Arthur gonna find out that Lancelot is um uh Guinevere's uh um his Vondo. Ooh, shit it is going to be so wild is that what we're gonna be getting Oh my god, please tell me this is going to be what happens. I will die if this is what happens. Let me know your thoughts in the comment section below, and remember to like, comment, share, and subscribe to Nerdigans Inc. Love what we're doing. I want to help keep this operation alive and kicking so we can keep bringing you more Fortnite's content. Any ways you could do that, donate to our cash shop, PayPal, Patreon, purchase something off our Amazon wish list, all that's in the description box below. Also, also make sure you follow us on Twitter, Twitch, Discord, friend us on PlayStation Network. That's in the description box below as well. Till next time, Nerdigans, I will be seeing you later. Bye.